and welcome back to more Pix plays after party we just found out we died 10 minutes ago we've been sent to go see the processor let's go see him How's it going? Yeah, Tuesdays are always slow. The custodians get bored. You know how it is. But the processing station's just down the way there. Start walking. You can't miss it. No. I'm gonna go this way. See if there's anything over here. And you can't stop me. But this pit of lava can. Can't even remember, like... When did we go to that party? Was there a party? How did we even die? I can barely remember anything. Look at this place. What, what are we even standing on? Is this a rock? Why, why is it sticking to my shoes? You know what? Screw it. I don't even... This has to be a mistake. We, we had plans. And people can't die if they have plans. And they can't get sent to hell if they babysat their neighbor's kids for free! Yeah, this feels like wine and sushi wrong. We should... We should, uh... Ask the processing station guy. Hopefully it's a person, and not like an automated ATM. Uh, I just can't believe this is happening! Hell cannot be real. It just doesn't make any sense. It's cheating! The whole universe shouldn't be that train station where I had my socks stolen! <laughs> hey, Milo, I'm as surprised as you are, okay? My mom made me go to church until I was 12. I mean, I, I just sat there and read Mad Magazine until I stopped hearing, Can I get a witness? Yes. <laughs> wrong. Way wrong. And, and, and there better be somebody at this station whose job it is to file paperwork somewhere. And, and, and we'll, we'll get this. They'll fix it. It'll get fixed. We're, we'll be fine. Sure. You, you kind of paused there before you said sure, do you? You know that? It kind of makes it sound a little like you don't believe it. Yeah. <sighs> All right. I guess we'll head to the processor now since there's no hidden goodies over there. Feisties. Flame and fun. Devil wings. A video game by Night School Studio. Janina Gavankar as Lola. Koi Dao as Milo. Dave Fenoy as Satan. Ashley Birch as Sam. Ashley Birch did the main character's um, Alex voice from Oxenfree. Aaron Yvette as Sister Mary Wormhorn. Jackie Tawn as Onoskelis. Some guy asked me if I wanted to go pound town, and I said, yes, can you go to my house and beat up my idiot husband, please? <laughs> wait, 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 look at this. It says, the scales of judgment, where Osiris weighed Satan against a feather in a drunken bet to see who gained the most weight over winter break. Okay. That makes no sense. Go past security. Down in LaFay's librarian. Hey, hey, either one of you guys, Jimmy Bolanger? James Whitney Bolanger? No. Nope. No, neither of us are whoever you're talking about, so don't, like, hurt us, please. Wrong vocation, but don't worry, I'm not too insulted. Well, sorry to bother you. Have a good one. Yeah, you too. Anything over here in the cut? No, but that's a taxi. There's not even enough screens in here. Hashtag feisties. Sir. Hey, hey kids. Hey, you want to buy rug? Listen, I got dodecahedrons, punch bowls, uh, uh, the toilet covers with St. Michael's face on them. Sorry, maybe we'll, uh, maybe we'll come back later. Yeah, they all say that. 
Well, get another job if you don't like it. Paul Bates as Asmodeus. Music by Scientific. Okay. Marcy Sullivan. Marcy Sullivan. Oh, uh, yes. Here. Here. Marcy, how you doing? Mm, not too good. Yeah, yeah, I know. Just proceed down to table three if you please. Thank you very much. Take as much. Take all day to get there. Yeah, there you go. Okay. All right, now, Lola, Lola Wolf. Is there a Lola Wolf here? Uh, sir, I, we think there's been a mistake since, uh... Please hold all stupid questions and dumb comments till after this part so I don't have to deal with it. Thank you. How about Sang Bong? Is Sang Bong here? Milo, you're up. Sang Bong? Anybody know this guy? Uh, sorry, but, uh, what, what is all this for? You know, I ask myself that very same question every morning. This, okay, this is weird. It says you two are going together. Uh, what does that mean? Proceed on to table two, please. Uh, I'd like to get home before my wife gets the good spot in the garage. All right, moving, moving right along. Is there an Abby here? Abigail Cunningham. Here. Yes, I'm here. Yes, good. That's you. Miss Cunningham, did you die with any metal on you? Any pieces of tin? N no, no, I, I don't think so. Uh, sometimes the Aztec judges mistake it for a bribe. I've seen guys end up somebody's bocce ball just because they forgot they were wearing a dream catcher. Mm -hmm. Okay, Abby, table four's got your name on it. Do you, do you know if, 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 is my mom uh, here? Probably. I mean, if she used air conditioning or ate tuna. Table four, please. I mean, air conditioning, though? Who, who, who doesn't use air conditioning? If it's available. Anything over here hidden? No. They usually have some things hidden in their, uh, in their games, so looking for some things. Seen nothing, so let's just sit down. Ah, well, that was something. Table I'm not going to make okay, it. Okay, that's... This must be us. You know, it's funny. I... I'm kind of... I feel like I'm sort of adjusting already. Like, I've just... I'm getting some level of emotional control, at least. That... Oh, my God! Milo, we're dead! We're <laughs> fucking dead! And we are in hell! How is this not hitting me before? We are in hell, and we are dead. Oh, Jesus Christ, Milo, I can't believe it. Yeah, I know, it's... There doesn't seem to be any bright sides here. Right? Hi, guys, I'm Barbados. No relation to the island, which... Uh, I hate that I even have to say that now. I'll be doing your personality audit before the processing commences. I have your file here on my phone. <laughs> Sorry, I'm coming from the gym. Look, we... There has... There's been a mistake. We don't... We don't even know why or how we died, so... Yeah, you know how when you're a kid, you stop remembering your infancy past a certain age? It's because your brain reconfigures itself to make more room. Ditto here. So, when you pierce the mortal veil, only the important stuff stays. Phone numbers, the smell of your mother's hair... So, okay, so... Do you know how we died? I surely don't. No sir, no ma'am, not my department. I don't do collections. Wait, wait, make more room? For what? We're dead. And how? You're gonna be here for a very long time. Like, for eternity. And a lot of new, mostly painful memories need their baby rooms made up before delivery. Which means the spank bank is getting converted whether you like it or not. Look, I know what this is. I've seen white guys bribe hotel clerks in movies, okay? Just tell us what you want to let us go home. Hmm? Oh, sorry, I wasn't listening. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Okay, this is novel, you two going together. Uh, normally that's reserved for murder, suicides, and moms with albino sons. Wow. <laughs> we'll tag team it, all right? Answer the following questions without thinking. Milo, regardless of the truth, have you ever suspected a lover was cheating on you? There are no wrong answers. Well, except that one. Uh, no, not really. No, not really. Okay. Cool. All right, Lola. Which image is closest to representing what was your ideal life? 
Okay, even though I'm sure this is a trap, the exec running shit. <laughs> I would have guessed that one for you. Ooh, I would have. That's so funny. You guys, can I just say, you're doing really well. Really? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Come the fuck on, man. Okay, you see that head over there? Uh-huh. Uh, I mean... Uh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fling that thing up into the hamper like you're George Gervin. All right. Kobe. Oh, mother. Good job is what I'd be saying if you'd made the shot since that was the test here. I'll just put you down as hands included, but questionable proficiency. Oh, kick rocks. This is a word association, so just say the first thing that pops into your head. Ring. Oh, wedding. Lola, drugs. No, thank you. Milo, crowds. Uh, tired. Milo, I mean, Lola, break. Like taking a break? What could this be, hmm? All the way from the deepest, darkest broom closets of your mind. Lola, what? The reigning pride of your ceaseless sorrow. The sultan of revulsion. The drain on your brain. That pebble in your shoe you just can't get out. I give you your personal demon! How in tarnation are you, man? I'm just so excited to be working with you, with anyone, really. It, it's just, I am so ready for this shit. We're gonna be a team, a real partnership. I want you to know that... Oh, crap, there's two of you? Oh, <laughs> I'm so sorry, little lady. I didn't see you there. But, uh... Oh, let me start over, okay? Whew. I'm Sister Mary Longhorn, and I will be assisting you guys with your mental anguish here in hell. We're gonna be brain bunkmates. You're hungry, I'm hungry, you're sad, I'm... I mean, that means I'm doing my job. <laughs> yeah, hi. Oh, hi! Sister Wormhorn here is your personal demon. Slow down, Barbados. What does that mean? Well, it's a comfort inhibitor only you and other demons can see. And it's so during your off hours, there's still somebody to nudge you into traffic sometimes. Off hours? Okay. Well, what, is, uh, what does that mean? I mean, could they not keep doing that? All right, so we're going to go this way first. See if there's anything. Now, probably isn't, but I like to check and be thorough. So let's check and be thorough. Not a thing. Okay. Is there a way to run? No run. Okay, so... We gotta wait for her to go over there in her boots. In his converses. Yeah, Dev, no. The fact that you only ate free range chicken doesn't change anything. Okay, now that you have all been appointed your personal demons, we can now assign you your torture. Your torture will take place during regular office hours by a certified sadist. Exempting holidays and Medusa's birthday, even though I don't know why we bother that, that bitch still says she's 39. <laughs> torture? I, I thought. Doesn't hell just, like, generically suck? Yeah, I didn't know there were seat assignments. I would think it an apparentness that cannibals and canoe tippers shouldn't get the same treatment. But yes, you all get different shit that happens to you. Abigail Cunningham? Yes? Your bones will be broken every day by a ball-peen hammer for the sin of repeatedly misusing the express lane in grocery stores. But I always have more than 15 things. Hmm. <laughs> What? She wasn't even that bad. Dev Sedana and Marcy Sullivan. Uh, no. It's you. I, we just did this like two minutes ago. He knows. Sir, um, sir, excuse me, but we, we are actually good people. I know you're eager to start eating worms and piss and sand, but this will just be a moment. Now, for robbing all those liquor stores, Dev will be suspended from a pole by his genitals. What? While children use your head like a tetherball, weather permitting. Marcy, your tits will be consumed by snapping turtles, only for them to regrow larger every day, giving you intense back pain when you jog. But, but, we, we only rob Jewish liquor stores. Oh, wow. Now, Milo and Lola, 
For the sin of... For the sin of being too late to get assigned to punishment, you get to wander the city until tomorrow. Have fun. See you later. I'm going to get drunk. Wait, what was our crime? Our, uh, our sin? Our hours are nine to six, guys. Can't you just tell us now? Come back in the morning when we're open. Okay, but... But what are we supposed to do until then? Sightsee, meet people, might as well carve out your shitting hole. And hey, don't worry. You'll be having maggots forced up your nose soon enough. I mean, well, damn. Well, what the hell are we supposed to do now? We will figure that out in the next episode. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, subscribe, share. All that helps to grow the channel. Videos go up weekdays on youtube.com slash morepics between 2 and 4 p.m. And until next time, be happy, be safe, and peace out. I'm that dude. I just do me. You should just do you. You can't do me.